When the current generation Blazer hit the market a couple of years ago, it ushered in new standards in ride, handling, power, and security. Its driver control system appealed to sport utility owners who weren't necessarily looking to blast down the off-road two tracks, but were looking for a measure of security in an otherwise pretty insecure world. One of the advantages that emerged from the research as we were launching the Blazer is that this product not only has a car-like ride, but it's very nimble in terms of its handling. And as we studied deeper and deeper into the thoughts that people had about that that evaluated our vehicles, we found that that was very important to them. It relates to the next level of security beyond just the four-wheel drive traction issue. And what they want is a sense of, of safety and security in the driver control system or the ability to have a superior, superior handling sport utility really hits the need of that market head on. Besides the driver control system, Blazer's sleek contemporary styling and roomy efficient interior have also been instrumental in making it Chevy's best-selling sport utility vehicle and second best-selling truck overall. Now you don't have to be a market analyst to know sport utilities like Blazer are hot sellers. Because Blazer combines the comfort and convenience of a passenger car with the toughness and capabilities of a truck, the market for this vehicle is expected to remain strong for years to come. Blazer's a truck young people aspire to and current owners stick with. It's a vehicle that takes on many different images, all of which are positive. And if you look at the wide variety of people and the wide variety of um, uses that these vehicles get, uh, I, I think it's uh, very interesting to look at so many different car segments. It's like the car defines uh, who the person is. And this is exactly the opposite. Uh, you can be uh, a female school teacher that's 20 years old. Uh, you can be a retired uh, professional. Uh, you could be a, uh, an auto worker or whatever. And you determine what the image of that vehicle is instead of the vehicle determining your image. For 1997, Blazer debuts some exciting new features aimed at your customer's desire for comfort, convenience, and luxury. Blazer also debuts a new ZR2 performance package available on two-door 4x4 trucks only. The package is designed for serious off-roading with a higher, wider stance, fender flares, and a long list of off-road suspension and driveline hardware. This is an extremely exciting vehicle. Uh, that sort of branches off from the Blazer in its normal, what we might want to call, character. Uh, the Blazer character, the ZR2, is much more aggressive. Uh, let's say it's a little bit of an attitude. This is the first true off-road um, vehicle of its kind. And this vehicle, the ZR2, it'll do what it looks like it'll do. The ZR2 package includes Bilstein high-pressure shock absorbers, special front and rear stabilizer bars, underbody shields, and large wheels and tires designed to take on rough terrain. In a sense, your dealership can be considered a sport utility store. That's because no manufacturer sells more sport utilities or more types of sport utilities than Chevy. Blazer leads this broad and best-selling sport utility lineup into 1997 with even more new features. So let's take a look, starting inside. Blazer's cabin is designed to be an owner's personal haven from the big bad outside world. But if folks want to let just a bit of that world shine in, they can do that with Blazer's new sunroof option, which is available across the model lineup. The new electric sunroof is one of those other items that, uh, quite honestly, we've been working on uh, for quite a few years. Uh, we could have come out uh, a few years ago with a sunroof, uh, pretty much like you see in small economy cars. Uh, the uh, Cut the hole in the roof, uh, let's plop it in there, put some sealant around it, and it pops up and you can remove it. And we looked at the customer who buys our blazer and we determined that no, that is not what's right for our customer. So we set out to really do a sunroof right. The sunroof includes a sunshade and an express open feature that opens the panel with one touch of the control. Homelink is another new for 97 optional feature. The Homelink transmitter allows Blazer owners to program their garage door and much more. Some people think, well gee, it's a garage door opener. Well, that's one of the things that it'll do. This system can be trained to operate any device 
uh, that works off of a radio frequency type signal. Uh, for example, uh, you can buy a system uh, that is like a little starter kit that uh, plugs into the wall in your garage and then you attach it into different lights uh, in your home or in some instances into security systems so that you have the capability as, as you drive up to your vehicle to turn on, turn off security lights or security systems. The home link transmitter is permanently mounted in Blazer's overhead console, a console that also includes a trip computer. The new trip computer provides owners with digital readouts for many mileage-related facts, including average fuel economy, range, and fuel used. Dual sun visors are standard on both LT and LS Blazers and fill a variety of convenience needs with a lighted vanity mirror and map strap to address the driver's visibility and safety needs, secondary shades and slider extensions help block the sun from two directions at once. And because it seems we're all working harder, Blazer supports our efforts with features that make drive time as efficient as possible. These two power outlets are provided for plugging in the tools of the business trade these days, the omnipresent cellular telephone or even a laptop computer. The auxiliary outlets are covered to be discreet, and if your customers need yet another power source, say for a fax machine or a photocopier, well, there's always the lighter receptacle. For those lucky drivers who aren't constantly checking voicemail or contacting associates, they'll find Blazer's designed from the inside-out interior to be very user-friendly. Analog gauges are easy to read through the leather-wrapped steering wheel, while sound systems range from a simple AM-FM radio to a CD player like this one. Blazer debuts an available automatic transmission floor shifter this year, and air conditioning is again standard on all models. The combination of Blazer's solar ray glass and R134A air conditioning refrigerant is enough to quickly cool the truck's interior on even the hottest summer days. Of course, Blazer also includes a standard driver's side airbag for enhanced security when used in conjunction with the safety belts. Much of the utility in Blazer's sport utility heritage can be found back here in the cargo area. A split folding rear seat helps the truck accommodate long items such as skis, while four cargo tie downs are at your disposal to help secure bulky items like golf clubs or luggage and keep them from rolling around. There's also this convenient net for keeping small items in place or bags of groceries tight against the rear of the truck. And all rear cargo can be concealed from prying eyes with this available pull-across privacy shade. Now the shade's easy for owners of all sizes to use because it's mounted on the side of the cargo area instead of the rear seat like some of our competitors. But the big news back here is this. Blazer's new liftgate design. Blazer's versatile new liftgate design is a no-charge option. It's available on four-door models and joins the standard tailgate as another choice for your customers. The new liftgate with lift glass is probably one of the greatest features that we are adding this year. Uh, it gives us an advantage over the competition because we do offer a choice. Uh, you have the traditional end gate or tailgate where the glass flips up and the tailgate comes down for extended loads. Uh, but also we've added this new lift gate. With this feature, all customers have to do to load small objects is lift the glass. But if they do need wide open access to the cargo area, well then the entire lift gate opens high and wide. And when you need to close it, there's this convenient grab strap. Again, while the standard tailgate is ideal for opening in tight locations or hosting pre-game parties at sporting events, the new lift gate gives customers a choice, something not available on other compact sport utilities. To help maximize space in the cargo area, four-door blazers feature an underbody mounted spare tire. And if even more carrying capacity is needed, a roof mounted luggage rack is standard on LS and LT models. This rack can handle up to 200 pounds of gear and has adjustable crossbars that are easily positioned back and forth without using tools. Blazer features a new type of fuel cap for 1997. And while it may not seem like a big deal, understanding how this cap operates could help your customers avoid irritating situations. As you know, we've added uh, onboard diagnostics, uh, or OBD2, uh, to the systems here in the, in the last couple of years. 
And that system, if the gas or if the fuel cap is not properly on the vehicle, and that means if you don't get the clicks when you turn it, um, that doesn't properly seal the system, uh, you'll get a warning light on your dash, and, and in many times you'll get poor performance in the vehicle. So this is just an attempt to try to make it easier and simpler, and you really know whether you, you have the cap on or not properly. This Easy On fuel cap pops out when it's opened and seals with just a quick quarter turn. That's all there is to it. A tether is also included to help prevent losing the cap. Now Blazer's styling has been updated recently and it shows with aerodynamic and contemporary lines. Flush doors and door handles contribute to a look that's both rugged and elegant. I think that uh, the, the Chevrolet Blazer uh, is a, a little bit unique vehicle out there in the segment. It looks just a little bit more different. Um, not quite as brutish or um, uh, truck-like as some of the other ones. And I think that's one of the things that uh, the younger crowd are looking for is just a little bit more styling in the vehicle. Blazer's standard base coat, clear coat paint treatment resists fading and provides a high gloss shine for long-lasting beauty. Up front, monochrome grills have been made available for 1997. We determined that the customer likes uh, on a little bit more luxurious vehicle. Surprisingly, not chrome, but they're looking for more of a monochromatic look. For 1997, the monochromatic grills will be available in six colors on LT models with solid paint treatments. Two-tone paint combinations will still be available with the traditional chrome grill. Blazer's halogen headlamps provide a bright, wide beam of light for nighttime driving. And after the sun comes up, Daytime running lamps make the truck visible to oncoming traffic. Daytime running lamps are just one example of Blazer's comprehensive safety system. The truck also features steel side door beams to help protect occupants and four-wheel anti-lock brakes to avoid accidents in the first place. And because youngsters tend to travel in the rear seats, child security locks are included at both rear doors to prevent the doors from being opened from the inside. Another source of security for all occupants is Blazer's exclusive driver control system. But what is it about the Blazer that makes it different? And I, I think if I, if I could really zero in on, on a few things, number one would absolutely be the superior ride handling control that's provided by Chevrolet's exclusive driver control system. Uh, the ability for the, 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 the uh, driver to feel as if he is in command of his environment. At the center of Blazer's driver control system is a group of premium suspension components. Shocks, tires, stabilizer bars, and more. Packaged together and fine-tuned to deliver the type of ride your buyers enjoy. Some customers opt for a smooth ride, and they have that choice. Others prefer a slightly stiffer touring ride, and they have that choice, too. Some even want to play in the dirt, thus the ZR2 package. In the past, what we learned when we had a wide variety of suspension components that cu customers could mix and match and put this tire with this suspension with this springs and everything, what well, we found out that, that many people didn't understand exactly uh, what those features were going to do with them, and they weren't exactly happy with the ride that they got. So what we decided to do was to sort of go at it from the reverse. And that is, let's determine how people utilize their vehicles. What kind of ride are they looking for? What are the primary road surfaces that, that they go on? Then what we decided was, let's tune a suspension that absolutely, specifically gets to that type of driving experience. And that's how we came up with the multitude of different suspension packages that we have. Although seven different suspension packages are available to Taylor Blazer's driver control system, all Blazers feature at their foundation a full ladder type frame that's boxed to the rear spring hanger area. There's also an independent front suspension that allows the front wheels to step over bumps individually and a power assisted variable ratio steering system. Providing the power to the driver control system is the proven Vortec 4300 V6 engine. This 190 horsepower 262 cubic inch engine is the largest displacement V6 in the class. But the features don't stop there. The Vortec 4300 V6 also boasts sequential fuel injection to ensure precise high-pressure fuel delivery to each cylinder. 
and a long list of extended maintenance items. To get anywhere near the type of performance that we get out of our standard engine, you have to upgrade uh, in the competition to a V8 engine. Uh, if you go with their six-owner engines, uh, you just absolutely do not have anywhere near the performance capabilities that you have with the Blazer. Another element in Blazer's driver control system is a four-wheel anti-lock braking system, which helps the driver maintain steering control during hard braking maneuvers. These tires are also critical to vehicle performance and a quiet ride. And of course, Blazer's available Instatrack four-wheel drive system can add a measure of control when off-roading or simply driving in snowy or icy situations. For drivers that desire optimum traction all the time, Blazer's all-wheel drive option is available on four-door LT models. For 1997, this system adds an important feature which can affect both security and performance. Another change that we've made this year uh, that we're very excited about, and uh, I think it's something that we'll see more of in the future, has to do with the all-wheel drive version. Uh, for uh, better safety, security, and, and actual performance, uh, we have gone to a four-wheel disc brake system on the all-wheel drive Blazer. For 1997, Blazers equipped with the all-wheel drive option will feature four-wheel disc brakes. These four-wheel discs replace the standard disc and drum brakes that's featured on blazers that do not have the all-wheel drive option. As you may know, disc brakes feature a plate-shaped rotor that attaches to the hub. When you apply brake pressure inside the vehicle, calipers and pistons force pucks or discs against the rotor and this creates friction which helps stop the vehicle. Drum brakes, on the other hand, don't use pistons and calipers to force the pucks or discs against the rotor. On drum brakes, when you put your foot on the brake pedal, a wheel cylinder forces the brake shoes into the drum and that provides the friction which stops the vehicle. That's the difference between drum brakes and disc brakes. The disc design used on this system cools faster than conventional brake designs, making it ideal for an all-wheel drive truck. Normally, the all-wheel drive system directs about 65% of the engine torque to the rear wheels and 35% to the front wheels. But when road conditions cause reduced traction at one set of wheels, the transfer case directs engine power to the wheels with better traction to enable Blazer to gain momentum. For 1997, Blazer continues to offer your customers a unique driver control system for a measure of security in an insecure world and an interior that was designed with driver and passenger needs in mind. Toss in exciting new features like an electric sunroof, the Homelink transmitter, and a new lift gate, and the stage is set for another successful year selling America's original sport utility vehicle, Chevy Blazer. 1997 is, is very exciting. Uh, on the surface you think, gee, there's, there's really not a whole lot happening with the Blazer. But, um, I, I think the way that we look at it is that, you know, when we came out with the Blazer, we got it right on drive, handling, driver control, uh, everything such as that, the, the physical features of driving the vehicle. The changes that we're making in 97, these are the things trying to anticipate and give the, the consumer that is now coming into this segment the more lux luxury items that they're looking for.